Hi, I'm Kyle, and we're here in the Tulip Experience Center. Today, I want to show you how by integrating Tulip automations with software-defined automation, a cloud industrial DevOps platform and Tulip technology partner, we're empowering our frontline users to interact with and monitor their automated systems directly from a Tulip app. Here at this station, we have a PLC-driven system that can run either two or three of these pushers to move product between the belts. However, if I want to switch between either these two or three pusher modes, I have to deploy a whole new configuration to the PLC. This could be for a number of reasons. Maybe I have memory limitations preventing me from loading a more flexible recipe, or maybe I want to add new hardware or data outputs as a result of some change. Luckily, SDA's platform allows me to version, edit, and deploy this new configuration to my PLC from the cloud, avoiding the downtime and loss related to manually redeploying to each line. With Tulip, I'm able to trigger these deployments remotely from an app, and that's what we see here. Here on my tablet, I have some monitoring data streaming to Tulip from the PLC over OPC UA. We can see that the system operates and sends OPC UA tag data to my Tulip app for visualization in graphs and other charts. Now let's change our configuration. Maybe I'm a production manager who wants to control my line without needing an extra seat in my PLC's IDE. Or maybe I'm a scheduling system, depositing new configuration requests in a Tulip table via API. As I click this button, I write a new request in the table. Now, Tulip Automations takes the wheel. A Tulip Automation takes this request and submits it to SDA via REST connectors. SDA then responds with some information and returns with the deployment information for the new configuration. Now, it's important to note that with Tulip Automations, all of this request and monitoring is happening headlessly in the cloud, independent of anything that's going on here in my app. Once this deployment is done, we can see the automation respond with new information in our system. And once we run our system, we can see that we now have successfully deployed our new configuration. Now that this deployment is done, we can see that our automation has also logged other important information like deployment speed and configuration details in our Tulip app. We can see this information here using Tulip analyses. Overall, by communicating to SDA's cloud industrial DevOps platform with Tulip automations, we're able to empower our frontline, adding tighter control and advanced flexibility to our automated system while capturing key metrics and completing production workflows headlessly in the cloud. For more information, check us out at tulip.co.